You're receiving my content. I'm singing on YouTube. Singing on YouTube. I am live now. Yay. So this is the pre-show. Welcome to the pre-show, everyone. Hi. You'll notice the dark lighting and the game up in that direction. Yes, it is that. That direction. The reason why I'm doing this is because when I was on my laptop, I kept pointing to be in my corner, which is that way. So I wanted to say that there's the image, but I pointed the wrong way. So I, my brain needs to get used to... There, that's the game. Directing you towards the game. Alright, so while I'm here on the pre-show, because I don't think anyone else is here yet, I'm going to have some fun, and I'm going to play some of my music from a musical I was writing. And... Hopefully we can have some fun with that. Blah, 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 blah. Completed. I think? No. Incompleted. Well, this is not just this is just not happening. It's not wanting to find itself. Uh... Hmm. Let's see if I can find it, everyone. Anyone here yet? Any watchers yet? Uh, da, 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 da. There we are. That's where it is. Do you have anyone on here? Feel free to come. Oh, we have one watching. Hopefully that's not myself. If you're watching this, please feel free to chat. I can ca talk to you in the chat. That is the chat. <laughs> I can talk to you guys. So if you guys put the comments and stuff. I'm on my home setup now officially so I can, you know, have my dual monitor. So for me, this way is my one monitor which I'm going to be playing the game on and this monitor over here is where I have the visuals so I can make sure I'm actually recording everything that I'm streaming. I can have transitions like, ooh, now I'm over here. Ooh, now I'm over there. And wow, now I'm over here got my logo working on it working on it okay guys it's a work in progress uh please be gentle i just realized that my full screen disappeared <laughs> come back full screen there we are no that's back that's good well anyways hopefully yeah hopefully we're gonna have some fun tonight um three minutes and i'm gonna start recording here's some music for you guys Uh, so yeah, this is music I've written for a musical I was working on a while ago. And I'm still working on because I can't find a theater that will... Let... Well, actually, I found theaters. I found theaters who were willing to do this with me. Um, the issue I was having was actors. First rehearsal for the last... So I tried the last two years in a row, and I would ask about 50 people if they were willing to show up. About 30 of them were like, yeah, like, for sure, man, no problems. I'll... When's the date? They, they talked with me all the dates and all that. Then the day came, and the first time, two people showed up. Second time, four people showed up. So, I wasn't able to put on a show either of those years. Uh, I'm working on a show that's just a one-man show that hopefully I can put out uh, and can submit to Fringe Festival soon. But yeah, because I like, hear some music, and I'm pretty proud of it. I'm pretty proud of this stuff, you know? I would sing this, but uh, my voice is not feeling it. <clears throat> Let's play!
It's definitely hard to do drums for this because it's in 3 4 time. Realize this song is a lot longer than I thought it was. was fun. Thanks for enjoying that with me. Alright, here we go. Into the game. Is everybody ready? Some things mustn't be forgotten. The shadow hunting me. <gasps> I must hurry. My name is Daniel. I live in London at, at uh, Mayfair. What have I done? This is crazy. Don't forget. Don't forget. I must stop him. Focus. My name is. Is. I am Daniel. Daniel. No. So, for those who have watched my last live stream, I played through this bit, like the first intro scene, once already, but things went wrong. <laughs> uh, I was on my laptop then, now I'm on my desktop, so the save file wasn't over here. Uh, so, basically, I'm just going to start from the beginning. But now you guys can hear audio this time, so that's awesome. You guys can actually hear the gameplay, so you guys will know what I'm talking about if I'm hearing clicking, or if there's a jump scare in the game, and it's so it's not just my audio. You can hear that as well. Let me know if anyone can comment. Let me know if you guys can actually hear me. Oh, this is interesting. So should be able to. Aha. Yes! This is so much better with uh, a mouse. Burn it! Burn it all! For those who don't know me, I am slightly a bit of a pyromaniac. And we are gonna have some fun here. Oh. Yes. All is good. Crystal clear. Cinder blocks is contains all the nuts I picked up. Alright, this is going to start getting scary pretty soon. Even though I know what's coming. Please don't die. I would like not to die. Ah! Jeez. But I want it. I want it! Oh god. <laughs> As I said, I've played through this and I'm still- I'm already getting scared. Uh, hold down left mouse and move in order to the door. There we go. Ta da! Oh man. Can't even imagine how scary this is gonna get when I've 
uh, get to the places where I haven't been. Oh, oh, <laughs> would you look at that? It's having some fun here. I already broke it, guys. This is not good. <sighs> How did I already break it? That's so funny. <laughs> Let's see, I think I'm supposed to go this way first. Because the wind blew. The wind doth blew. Fireball! Oh, I guess that didn't really do anything. Well, anyways, move forward. Never backwards, and always twirling, twirling towards freedom. Ah! Rage. Rage against the machine, guys. And never leave a door not closed. Okay, guys, like that's just bad for the uh, air conditioning. Just make sure you close all your doors. Is this still broken? Yes. <laughs> oh no! Look! I've been impaled! <laughs> I got some wood I can grab onto here. If you know what I'm saying, ladies and gentlemen. That's right. Innuendos. My Let's Plays are full of them. Wait, I forgot to close the door. See you guys, that's what I'm saying. Gotta make sure. Gotta be good for the insulation here. So I'm probably just gonna go straight up till midnight for tonight, just because I don't want to make my let's plays too long anymore. What the hell is that? Go away, demons. Demons! Go away! Go grab your face. Chuck it off. How do you like that? Because I do not like what's happening around me. Oh gosh. Oh god. No, 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 no. Move. Stay alive. Staying alive. Staying alive. That's what we do. Because Isaac's scared. Tage is manly, though. Thank you. Oh god. That's a doorway. Throw it at you. Take that, demon door. Hop in. This is my new home. Thank you for coming. All the witchcraft. Alright, let's see here. Let's go. Oh, what was that? Was that in real life or is that in this game? Maybe it's a bit of both. Lots of jackets here. Like, there's nothing much really in these except for jackets. Does anyone know why that is? Okay. Oh god. Beware, staying in darkness to slowly, slowly drain. Whew. A slight headache. Moving forward, ladies and gentlemen, and those who have yet to decide, or those who choose to self uh, not self-identify. The other children cheered him on, his name voiced in a steadily rising pace, urging him to do it. Am I really doing this? The young boy thought, and struck his victim with a rock. <laughs> yes. Yes, that's not very good. Yes! Demon lighting. And so doth the prophecy proclaim. Yeah, thank you, flashlight. Ha, <laughs> books. I like books. 
and beat your enemies down with knowledge, everyone. That's, that's how you win. Just boom, boom, crack on the head. Mm, yeah, like that. That's how you get 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 the enemies, guys. Oh jeez. Penis, penis, penis. I'm hearing squiggly squigglies. I don't like it. Is it this water? Is that what the squiggly squiggly is? Ah. Ah, maggots! Kill them all! I feel like I'm gonna die. Is that, is that possible? I still haven't died yet when I was playing this last time. Alright, I gotta get out of here because this is not fun. I'm just gonna close doors because remember, can't let in a draft. Alright. What the hell, but what's going on here? Pages. Knowledge is power, children. Alright, I think I remember this. Oh god. No, I do not remember this. What? 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 It fell over. Don't fall over, little lamp. Pressing F key. Ha ha! I'm a genius. Knowledge is power! Take it, take it like a man, you pole. Mmm, you like that, yeah. Nice sensual rubbing of the book. Okay, this is getting weird. I mean, it's already weird, but I mean... It's getting weirder. Okay, this isn't even the room I thought it was. Oh, wow. Uh, Good job, me. Scrolls. Alright, making good progress, though, because it's only been like 10 minutes of me actually playing this. And I'm actually doing pretty well, in my mind. Alright. So that's shaking. Those don't light up very well. And a rug! A nice cozy rug by the fire. Cozy up with some friends and family and loved ones. You know, just enjoy the time we have together. And then cook everything alive! Kick everybody! Shove everyone into the fireplace and kill them all! All of them! Kill them! I'm going mad already. <laughs> I don't know why I'm having so much fun with this now that I'm on my <laughs> computer and not on a laptop. I'm just, just gonna tear shit up. I wanna open it! Open. Open for your majesty. Alright, no, this is the room. Here we go. Don't be afraid, Daniel. I can't tell you why, but know this. I choose to forget. Try to find comfort and strength in that fact. There is a purpose. You are my final effort to put things right. God willing, the name Alexander of Brandenburg still invokes bitter anger in you. If not, this will sound horrible. Go to the inner sanctum. Find Alexander and kill him. His body is old and weak, and yours Young and strong. He will be no match for you. One last thing. A shadow is following you. It's a living nightmare, breaking down reality. I have tried everything, and there is no way to fight back. You need to escape it as long as you can. Redeem us both, Daniel. Descend into the darkness where Alexander waits and murder him. Your former self, Daniel. Oh, spooky. Every time I read it. Well, he reads it, I guess. You know, Good voice acting, I guess. You know. 
set last time. It took me about like an hour or something to find that little lover. I like went all the way searching through the halls and it's just like, oh, lover. Done. Oh jeez, never mind. Keeping the light on. Yeah, that's right, you go away, you little mongrels. So yeah, still so just one viewer. I was hoping for a bit more of an audience than that. See what's my one. See if my one friend will join us. Question mark. All right, keep going. I think there's a cutscene up here, and I'm trying to remember what else I've done. Alexander, is it inside the castle? In a manner of speaking. Come, bring the lamp. You've been to the refinery, have you not? I don't believe I have. Is it connected to the... What did you call it? The inner sanctum. My most precious chamber, Daniel. And it lies well beyond the refinery. In fact, it lies beneath the very stone of Brennenberg. Fascinating. So I'll try and see if I can speed run everything here that I was doing last time. Because there was a lot that I had done. I remember walking this way. I think. And then grab this. Radio. The demon. Is, I mean, uh, right, innuendo, sticking to innuendos. A slight headache. Oh. Alright, so let's see, I think. I'm trying to remember where we're going to Oh, laboratory, there we are. The door slammed shut behind him, and he knew he would never again see the old tailor at Berkeley Square. Another lone soul in London seemed appropriate somehow. Bird calls. Just like your mama. Mm -hmm. So for those who don't know, I don't make any sense, but just, just enjoy it, okay? Just sit back, relax. Oh, penis. Enjoy my non- Enjoy my nonsense, and we'll all get along just nicely. If you don't enjoy my nonsense, then bugger off. Ah, I'm just kidding. Stick around, yeah. Yell at me, call me your, call me your little plaything. I like that. Ooh. Baskets. More baskets. How many of these do I have? I have six left, so I might keep that. Just so I can light this one instead. Torches. Can I lift that one? Yeah! Woo! Tinder boxes. What if I throw this off? Is there more hidden back here? No? Oh, okay. The lack of a chimney to properly vent the fumes from my most recent experiments has taken its toll on many of my less stable ingredients in storage. Some seem unaffected, but many are stained by the fumes, and they will be difficult to salvage. I shall do what I can and move them to the wine cellar. So, the wine cellar. We now know I need to go to the- oh jeez, I didn't mean to do that. The wine cellar. Oh, balls. Ah. Uh, there should be more Cooperite. Let me see. Let me see. And one part Aquaforce.
This is my third attempt to produce artificial vitality. The former compounds lack the potency I need, and but I sense I'm close. Calamine and Opriment are a given, and the copyright binds them well. This time I will attempt Aqua Regaia instead of Aqua Fortress. I hope it will produce a more even solution. The experiment was unsuccessful. The solution is highly acid and proves impractical to put any use except as a detergent. Ha! <laughs> detergent. Organic tissue reacts especially violently to the solution and should be handled with the greatest care. I might be able to use the recipe, but I'm losing hope that it will find an alchemic solution to my predicament. Uh -huh, he's losing hope in his alchemy. That's what I need to learn there. Tinder boxes! <laughs> Can light so many fires downtown with this. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, I'm trying to grab this and the camera's shaking and I don't appreciate it. Demons of hell go away right now. I'm trying to collect things. What the hell is this? I don't even remember getting this. One day I will return. If it wasn't for the thought of you, my love, I wouldn't be able to go on. When I find myself doing terrible things, I take comfort in you. As long as I'm able to think of you and long for a life together, I know I'm better than the others. I weep for them. They lust for power without restraint, where I only crave fair judgment and a safe return. Well, that's haunting. So if I click it again. So that, I want to pick it up though. Let me take it with me. That is interesting. Moving forward. See, so if you're wondering why I, had, I promised I would release uh, episodes of like, Let's plays later earlier on than I was playing let the live streams earlier. But this last week has been extremely busy, so I'm looking to hire myself a video editor so that I can just do the gaming and the commentary and then they'll just edit everything. Apparently they enjoyed my voice or whatever. A fragrant taste of rose lingered in his mouth. Turkish delights, he thought, just as like the ones at the consult the cons consulate and whatever. Words. So if I can get that video editor to help me out. It's too late for you. You're dead. Um, so hopefully that video editor can help me out so that I can... I just locked. Uh, they can, I can start releasing actual episodes as opposed to just doing live streams. And then I had stopped doing live streams because I was away doing work in a different place with my laptop and it was just not working out very well. Finding the time to do everything. So. Hopefully, I can start doing what I promised and start getting some videos out here. I wonder why it won't budge. <laughs> so I think I'm going into unknown territory here. Traveler, traveling to Dover meant going through Canterbury. He made sure to pay a visit to avoid the sense of guilt connected with the neglect of family. How dare you neglect your family? With Mother Day is so recently. Come on, don't neglect your family. Give your mother something worth special. Okay, I do remember this. Alright. I don't remember everything I need to do in here. Take that, demon. Everything's a demon, guys, just so you know. Later that evening, we uncovered a passage beneath the dunes leading to a sand covered stone structure. The professor was confident it was the tomb we sought and ordered the others to clear the way late into the dark. Our Russian friend! Night. Tomorrow, I shall lead the men into the ancient structure, hoping to reach the burial chamber. No matter what the professor is keeping from me, the dig should yield something interesting to take back to London and the British Museum. I'm trying to remember if it was Aptum or Adam. I think it was Adam, if I remember correctly. But thanks for coming back! It's good to see you, man! Where have you been? <laughs> Did you just watch my uh, live streams then? <laughs> oh, by the way, I, was, I went back and I checked and apparently I think it was... Zdrasdvutie doesn't actually mean thank you like I thought it did. It meant hello. So, Zdrasdvutie. Oh, 
Alright, so let's get going here. Yeah, actually I found all my old notes from when I went to, was trying to study Russian back when I was in high school, so I was hoping to learn a bit more and start using them on the live stream. Do like a bit of Russian as part of this. <laughs> Rage against the chairs. Cause that'd be fun. Alright, so let's remember let's remember things. Well, this is properly spoopy. Let's see again here, no. I hereby offer my full attention and services to Alexander. Baron of Brunnenberg, this contract will reign for a total of three years from when my freedom shall return to me. In addition, Alexander, Baron of Brunnenberg, is to recommend my services at the Prussian Royal Court, and within the sanctum of the Order of the Black Eagle, may no man break this seal. Wilhelm, House of Gerich. I'm almost out of oil. I'll fix that. All right, it's back in it. Let's see. So uh, I think we can get progress compared to last time. I, I think you were watching my, at least my, uh, what was it? My last live stream of Amnesia. So if you're watching that, no, I think you were watching. I'm trying to remember what you were watching. It might have been Factorio. Can't quite remember. Oh, jeez. Demon piano. Blink, blink, blink. This... Does not look familiar. I'm already getting lost. Alright, so let's see here. Oh, jeez. I'm hearing pianos playing. It's never a good sign. How can I be going this insane this quickly? More oil, lovely. Do 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 do. Hopefully, if you were watching this, you liked my. Oh, have you been watching this whole time then? Thank you! I'm glad you enjoyed it. Oh my goodness, yes, um... <laughs> well then, I'm now I'm blushing. Cause yeah, again, like, I really want to perform that on actual like live stage at some point. But it's been proving very difficult to do so. Cause actors. Fascinating. Yeah, the song that you were, we were listening to earlier was um, called Insanity. It's part of a musical that's based around the characters of Batman. Yes. Legal copyright. DC, call me. I want to work for you. <laughs> yes. Okay. That was Demons. Don't like it. Seventeenth of May, eighteen thirty nine. My hands tremble as I write. I feel a need to document my tribulation, for I fear that my memory will fail me if I linger. Today, I took some men and ventured into the dark, ancient passage we uncovered. 
Our torches burned faintly in the murky air as we slowly made our way underground. The men were superstitious and fearful. They argued loudly, and I felt their strange language getting to me. I mustered my strength and yelled at them to continue down the slopes and broken steps. The crudely carved passage confused me. It looked much older than the 4th century structure we had expected. The twisting path emerged into a great antechamber. The walls were lined with statues unlike any I'd ever seen. Despite their unearthly quality, I felt a strange familiarity toward them, which haunts me still. At the far end of the chamber, a great slab of stone sealed off whatever lay ahead. I gave the order to raise it, and as I pushed through the narrow space, the heavy stone suddenly dropped, sealing me inside. I was trapped. Hmm. If, some, if the songs are in your head, I hope that's I hope that's a good thing. <laughs> Cause yeah, it'd be awesome. Cause again, I wrote that one especially to be like very catchy and very familiar. Cause again, it's like the first song we actually hear in the whole musical. And yeah, there's talking dialogue over it. It's just I, I love it to be pieces when he actually. I actually got a couple of my friends together. It's like not for a rehearsal or anything. But I got about ten people all over for a party and said, "Hey guys." I wrote this musical, do you want to do a read-through? So we had a whole huge read-through of the musical, and it actually sounded awesome getting to hear voices on top of the music. And I do have Steam, yes. If you are looking for my Steam name, I will have to give that to you then. Pausing the game. Actually, wait, can't I just... Shift 1? Something like that. I don't know. Now, let's see here. Z470 is it what it is. So I'll type that in for you. If you want to add me on Steam. That's locked. Where did I come from? Where did I go? Where have I come from? Cotton Hat Joe. Boxes. Alright, so I think I'm getting close to where I was. But I think I've done more this time. Oh god. <sighs> Scary. I see that you've added me on Steam. I'll uh, accept your friend request and all that. Lovely. Yes. Wait, what? What? 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized... Pausing. Yes, I will add you. Yes. It's probably better if I'm up here now. I'm back into it. It was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. I don't remember this at all. was waiting for me. 
Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. More pianos playing. find this relic so that I don't go mad. Oh jeez. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here, here, and there. Let's get the servants working Coming on soon. What's coming soon? Jeez. All right. Oh, jeez. You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can never be too careful, then. This is a pain in the butt to do on a laptop, I can tell you that right now. Huh. Another region rich with lore is Alstadt. Deep within the East Prussian woods, for centuries there have been stories surrounding the hamlet and its neighbor, Castle Brennenburg. The quiet forest clad mountains dressed with scattered lakes is as picturesque as it can be. Albeit the area is haunted by the dark, ask any local and you will hear proof of the widespread superstition. All travelers should indulge themselves in such conversations since it will certainly serve as exciting entertainment. All of them with their own twists on the tales, but there are some motives that keep reappearing. This story reaches all the way back to the time of the Thirty Years' War. It is said that soldiers who abandoned their duty got lost in the cold dark woods and who were forever doomed to roam the grounds. Their bodies wrought by their tainted souls have them left disfigured and empty of essence. Many have sighted them over the years and described them as horrid revenants. They move silently through the woods, shying away from any boy holder. They are cold gatherers, and they seem to follow some ambition to steal living creatures. It is their prey which can be heard struggling inside damp burlap sacks dragged behind them, which reveal their presence. What dark scheme do they follow? Heinrich Cornelius Agrippa the well-known erudite visited Alstadt at the start of the 16th century. He resided in the local inn for a fortnight as he looked for remnants of kingdoms past. During his stay, all the prominent members of the society paid notice, and he is mentioned in many records at the time. One day, he went to investigate a burrow in the northwestern glades, only to never be seen again. Heinrich is known to have passed away in Grenoble some ten years later. 
He dismissed the notion of ever visiting Alstad, which makes you wonder what really happened. Who was this mysterious man? <sighs> who was this mysterious man who visited the sleepy hamlet in the woods and what happened to him? The Baron of Brennenburg lives a reclusive life with his family at his castle nearby Alstad, and like most those of noble birth, rumors are inherited alongside with the title. Researching the history reveals little before the castle that was consumed by fire in the late 16th century. It was rebuilt by Alexander, a nobleman from the Rhinelands, claiming the role as protector of the Prussian state. Alexander helped the region to flourish and remained popular throughout his presumed lifetime. The family has always been secretive when it comes to lineage and heritage, therefore the birth and death of Alexander and his offspring has never been fully recorded. This has fed the idea that the Baron is in fact the one and the same who came from the West over 300 years ago, lived through the time of occupation, and joined the coveted order of the Black Eagle along with the great leaders of this country. And why don't I take this book to smash another book? Now I have two books. See, I'm so very clever, everyone. I have two books. And that one's locked. Interesting. Oil. Alright. Oh, jeez. Barricade the doorway. Perfect. Oh, jeez. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their and and absent-minded handling of the human vessels. The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye on the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they not can rot for all I care. Maybe I'll feed them some wine. It would, in a sense, solve both of my problems. Oh man, something sounds like there's something going on with this wine cellar, man. Come on, man. Alright, I'm tempted, because last time I played, this is where I left off. So I think I'll go a bit further, I think. So I have a key. Is it to the wine cellar? Oh, wow. That door is open. No! It's never a good sign. Oh, it's... Oh! Where'd you look? What? Sand trickles from this crumbling stone ceiling and pushed down on the brim of his hat. He braced himself as the cavern suddenly shifted and settled.
I'm so scared. I've seen that goblin like twice now. Not goblin orc, I guess. Statues were praying, gazing into the dark, domed ceiling. I am not enjoying this anymore. <laughs> Enjoying this anymore. I was having fun exploring the story. Why would you tell me that game? Having fun. <laughs> Jingling sounds. Not good that, that got closed. It's 
not good at all. Not enjoying this. I'm sure, yeah, that, of course. Of course, something's gonna happen. Making progress, I think. I could almost call it quits for tonight. <laughs> That's what I'm looking forward to. storm. We're not getting out of here. How can you say that? Alexander, you piece of shit! Let us out of here! <laughs> so, don't drink the wine. I think that's... Don't be alcoholics, guys. My name is Wilhelm, House of Gerich. These are my final words, my confession and testament. Two years ago, I was summoned to the castle of Brennenberg. As most of the aristocracy 
I was curious about what this was supposed to, what this supposed knight of the order could want from me, and accept the invitation. The Baron was friendly and offered me a proposition. It dawned on me that the nature of the contract was sordid, and that the reason I was chosen was because of the follies of my past and not the honors I were rewarded with during my time as a soldier. I was to kidnap healthy humans upon his slight whim, on his slightest whim, and do so without asking questions. In return, he would attest to my character at the royal court, advancing my position within noble society. I would like to claim that I struggled with my decision, but it came swiftly and I accepted wholeheartedly. Ever since the day I have brought men, women, and children to Brennenberg. I can't remember the numbers, but there were many, perhaps even a hundred, none of whom were ever seen or heard from again. Tonight the Baron invited me and my men down to the wine cellar to celebrate our work. I had my suspicions as we descended the stairs, but he insisted and joined us in a toast. The wine tasted fine, and my men drank without restraint. So it begins the punishment for our sins. The Baron has locked us up and returned upstairs. Forgive me for what I have done. I was weak and fell into his diabolic ways. My men were screaming. Their skin has been pierced by their own tangled bones. I feel my insides revolt against their God-given nature. Blood has begun to pour from my eyes, and I can no longer... Can no longer what, my good sir? After enduring three days in Algiers, a sailboat was finally arranged to take him across the Mediterranean Sea to Gibraltar. Having reached British territory, it was just a matter of reserving a cabin on SS Hortensia. I had to Oh, man. Getting close to saying this is, shall be the end soon. Ah, jeez. Let's take the wheel. Take it from my hand So it looks like I've taken all the reds upstairs and over there So that's still blocked off so I think it's just down here left to be trapped and I appear to think that this might be the time to me pause it. Thank you for joining me today. This has been Amnesia with Tate. Have fun. Stay beautiful.